How to add hyperlinks to Canva website. Hey everyone and welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you step by step how to do so. Now, this is going to be a very simple and easy thing to do on Canva. Um, so let's just go ahead and get to it and show you how to do so. So first you would want you would want to create a website, or if you have one already, just go ahead and open it up. In my case, I'm just going to be using this one. So I'm just going to open it up, and then you would want to click on it to start editing it. So once you're in the edit mode, we can just go ahead and start creating um, our hyperlinks. So in my case, I'm just going to create a new page and start from scratch. I'm just going to add a design here like this one. And let's just go ahead and remove everything. So to get started without anything that you have, you can feel free to just go ahead and click on uh, or hover over the text option and add some text here. You would want to type in whatever you want. So you can just do something like click over here and then to make it a hyperlink and to make this clickable and takes you to another link all you need to do is just go ahead and click on the three dots right on top of it so you would first want to click on it obviously and then you would want to click on more which are three different dots i mean three dots at the top of it and you will find this link option so you just want to click on it and then it's just going to ask you to add a link now if it's a canva website you can also basically make it uh, redirect to another page so for example if you want this button to uh, direct people to the home page you can just go ahead and click on this one and so on so you can just go and select whichever page that you actually want or if you want you can just simply put in any website that you want so for example google uh, dot com so this way, if somebody clicks on that text, it's actually going to take them to google.com. Now, in the case, it does actually um, underline the text. Let me just go ahead and do it again and show you. So let's add a subheading. And let's also make it a hyperlink. So click here. Let's this time, uh, let's say we just have a bunch of text and we only want the here to be the hyperlink in that case you just want to highlight it and again just click on the three dots link and then you would want to go for google.com or whichever website that you want or a page and just hit enter now in the case that it does actually have an underline uh in this case as you can see it does have an underline you can just go in and highlight it uh and then you can just go in and remove the underline from it and we did remove it uh so Basically, once you highlight a specific text and make it a link, it's actually going to underline it for you. Now, it's not only going to work with text. Uh, it's also going to work with pretty much all the elements that you, that you add. For example, if we just go to elements and we just search for button. And then from button, we can just go to graphics, select anything in here. So let's just go and select this one. We can actually go ahead and click on the three dots and again just add the link to it and this time let's just go ahead and add the home page as the hyperlink and click on done so now this is also going to be clickable and it's going to redirect us to the home page so this is all for this video hopefully you found it to be helpful and thanks for watching